I had to talk about the new class structure. Um, I know we've we've actually highlighted it already, but this is important. Uh, we're starting today. Uh, we're ending in 30 days, 30 days from today. Uh, this class, right? There are certain things, certain markers that you want to hit in these 30 days, especially in the next few days. Um, here's the first one. You made it to the lab. Check. I'm glad you're here. Uh, your poster, which we're going to talk about uh, in a few moments, is due tomorrow night. Can everyone write that down? I know you don't know what it is, but I want you to write down poster due tomorrow. Does everyone have that? Poster is due Sunday night. Got it? Write it down, and I'll explain in a moment. Lab two is 6 p.m., where we do the essay structure. Got that? So there's at least two more things that we need to do over the next 48 hours. You got to submit your posters and you got to do, you got to be present at the lab. And then you're off and running. And then it's off and running uh, from um, until that final Monday on the end of the class, right? Um, if you haven't already, some things I think you should, you should do. <clears throat> I think you should print off your packets if that's something that's important to you because the packets and the modules end in 30 days. So if that's something that's important to you, print them off. Got it? Yes? You should have three packets. There's packet one, there's packet two that looks like this, and there's packet three. Does everyone have those? This is the first packet. Second packet. Third packet. Packets one, what we're doing now, and packet two is math. Uh, and they're going to look like this to match it with the videos. Packet three is going to look something like this, and that's for science. Teachers that are doing science would do that section there. Okay? All right. Um, when you, um, does everyone feel like, uh, okay, good, 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 good. I don't think I have to clarify this because you're doing it now. I don't want to I don't want to spend time clarifying this again. The 3-day webinar, let me ask you a question. Actually, let me do. Let me do I take a moment and clarify this, okay? We had a format, it was a 3-day webinar. Teachers loved the convenience of it, but the the feedback from teachers was that it was too fast and it was it's just really hectic because there's so much information in 3 days. So we're doing a new format here. It's more self-paced. And we added in these things like um, these, this stuff like uh, uh, like the uh, the intro that we're doing now, and and something called pre and post test consultations, which I'm going to talk about in a little bit. Ways to get teachers a little bit more engaged. At the end of this, I'm going to ask you what your thoughts are on on this stuff here for the new stuff. But we're, we we want to cover the gist is is that we want to cover the same content that we would in a three day webinar just give you lots of long, much more time um, to cover it over the 30 days. Who likes that, by the way? Who likes having uh, 30 days as opposed to three days? And having it be uh, self-paced as opposed to fast-paced. And, you know, I know I, I got you out in the morning at 7 a.m., but this is like the last time I'm going to do that. Now you get to decide when you want to do it. A lot more flexibility. And now we're doing these intros. And, and I'm going to act, you know what? I'll wait till we do the lab on Monday and then I'll get your feedback. And I'm just curious what your thoughts are because this could also have been done totally self-paced, pre-recorded. And, and maybe maybe that's good too. Some teachers like the, the a little bit of interaction. So I'm trying to give a little bit of interaction to help you get started. Well, I'll, I'll save that for the for the end of this in this class here. I'll ask that question a little bit. Uh, team, does everyone feel like right now, because you're taking the lab, you know how to get to the pre-workshop homework study material and the practice exams? Is that a yes? And how about this? Do you feel like now you're ready to start the class? Now you can go and you can you've done the intro. We're almost done. Not quite done, but almost done. You can start the actual section on number sense. Yes. So now you're like, hopefully, okay. Um, remember when you do that first section on number sense, the black is just the intro. 
It's an intro video that talks about the big ideas. The blue is all the tutorials that walk you through. Let me see that question. Marissa, I know you asked that question. You can still take the MTEL Flex if you want. Okay. I have a separate video on the MTEL Flex. You can, you can type it into uh, YouTube and it's an hour long video on the MTEL Flex. Okay. You can take a look at that if you want to. Patricia, if you don't know what the Flex is, you can type into Google, uh, YouTube. MTEL Flex Go Academy, and you'll see a one hour video on it. Okay. Yes, you still have another couple months. Okay. There's a one hour video on that. All right. Now back to this team. You got the basic structure. You're going to do the black, then you're going to do the blue. Yes. And if there's a question, what are you going to do with these questions here? You're going to ignore them. Chris isn't going to notice. He hasn't noticed that I haven't been commenting. You're going to answer them. Answer it. Every time you answer it, you get a little bit more engaged. And other people see your answer and they learn from your answer and it's a little bit more interactive. Yes? Big thumbs up. Find a way to interact with that comment box, okay? When you get to a question, whatever it is, I always want you to take um, two minutes. I want you to read it to yourself, okay? Uh, do not treat this class, the self-paced class, like uh, Netflix. Who has Netflix? Who's got Netflix? <laughs> do not multitask this, this class out where you're just like, you're, you're watching the video and you're, I don't know, driving. Don't do that, team. I mean, just please don't do that. Just find a quiet space, take two minutes, read the questions, and then go through the, the modules. Thumbs up. But you need two minutes just to read it. I do not want you to be doing this while you're driving. I'm doing the class while driving and talking to my friend. Don't do that. Take two minutes, read it on your own, then go through the stuff. That's the whole problem with the, the three-day class. It was too fast, okay? So don't make that mistake that you're going to see these classes are very fast the way that it was recorded. Okay. But you're going to see in the comments, you're going to see teachers ask questions in the comments and me not being able to respond because the class was just too fast. So you can fix that. Um, you can go through and you can read it to yourself and then use this as a way to check your answer and things like that. Okay, all right, uh, how about this one right here? Let's talk about, um, we already talked about 30 days. So what is the 30 days for you? What does that mean for you? When is the 30 days over? We start on the 9th, and when's it end? October 10th, October 9th, thank you, October 9th. That's for everyone. So something happens um, in two weeks from now, it's, it doesn't matter, it's for everyone. And that's just the policy we're doing for all the classes, okay? And I, I hope you will honor that and respect that, okay? It's a 30-day class, which means our 30-day game. And you've really got to, you got to make the most of it while you're, while you're in it, okay? And it is self-paced. And what this means is because these are big exams, you've got to find a pace. I'm just going to write down one hour a day. Can everyone write that down? An hour a day. You've got to train. It, this class can be done in seven days, okay? But I think that everyone's different here. Try and fit in an hour a day, right? Give me a thumbs up. I know some teachers are going to be like, I can only do 30 minutes. Some teachers are like, I'm going to do four hours. Not many, but some. Try and fit in an hour a day. You, you're running a marathon here. There's going to be work. It is self-paced. No one's holding your hand here. I'm leaving. We're ending this session in about five minutes. Okay? No one will be holding your hand. You've got to train for this. You got to want this. You got to want this. She's got to want it. He's got to want it. She's got to want it. You've got to want it. Yes? You have to do, you have to find the motivation to train. And, and an hour a day is a fair amount. Some will do more, some will do less, but an hour a day is a good goal. Okay. All right. Labs. Let's talk about labs real quick. 
Uh, first off, uh, the live labs, who has gotten something out of this intro? Learn something about the test? Okay, so we can, we're almost there to check this one off. And we have a second one here um, on Monday night. Okay, who's going to attend that one? I hope you do. That's when we go through the essay structure for the new 78. So this is just for the 78 test, okay? Just for the 78 test. Okay. All right, well, do your best because this is a really important one. Okay.